hello. Let's uh, put Wednesday's bad score behind us and go into the weekend feeling better about ourselves because we're doing Diverse World again as redemption. At least that's the hope. Um, balls on the line. Reputation. Out there. Um, I don't know any other necks on the line. Um, toilets without a door. Books on a shelf. Tiny sitting. It, I thought they were watching TV. Anyway, it is your Friday and my Fridays. GeoGuessr edition. We are here. We are figuring out if this is actually uh, Bangladesh, India, Thailand. This is a bug, a mosquito thing. Let's kind of get into the region of the world I think I'm in. Anyway, how are we doing? How are you doing? I hope it's all fine. Let's kind of look at the writing here. Okay, I don't think it's here. There's missing a lot of like top bars on stuff. Is this Bangladeshi? No, because they use the, it feels like everything's written on a line, so it's not that. Is it Burma or Myanmar? Leading more towards Thailand. Potentially Cambodia. So around here. Anyway. Man, but these words make me think. Dumb things. We're uh, doing it. How's your week been so far? It's been uh, pretty fast for me, mainly just because uh, it's a four-day work week. And it's... Uh, <clears throat> throwing me for a loop, and I'm not really used to it being actually today, Thursday, and tomorrow, Friday, but here we are. We're uh, going through the days like it or not, and I've still been busy getting paint off of a uh, deck, and I don't know if my phone vibrating is coming through or not, but having more texts come through. Yeah, I'm not getting anything. I'm hoping for a flag now at this point since um Regional Development Bank. Usually these will tell me Sri Lanka. Ah, okay. Good thing I was bailed out. Uh just click there for now. If I can't find a uh so this is Sri Lankan, huh? I would not have gotten that. I would have had a bad score to start, and I would have gotten miffed. But, again, manual labor you do for people you care about somehow doesn't seem as bad. It's the same thing when I hear people talk about kids and the misery they put you through for years, or the, when they first get home and they just cry and do nothing, and you're just like frustrated and exhausted with sleep, and everyone's just like, well, it's worth it, though. I don't know if how much of that is just instincts making them think that, or if it's just a genuine feeling, or if there actually is a difference between the two and if it matters. That is a weird walk he has, it feels like. Anyway, um, doing that, baking a lot more, keep trying to make... I'm, I'm very much a big fan of cornbread. I keep trying to make really good cornbread, but the problem is, and ooh, we have... Kathani? I need to back up a smidge. Cat to thith. Cat to thith. Th oh, I ran out of time. And I have issues. And a lot of people, um, there'll be like certain things in the news when you hear about like people doing dumb things and like, well, why the fuck did he do that? It was such a dumb, obvious like thing not to do. Or like you hear somebody talk about um, doors not opening the way they would. And then they make complaints being like, why doesn't the door open outwards when it should? You know, it's more of like a, you fucked up kind of like, um, this is France, I believe. You kind of fucked up in a way. And it's a little embarrassing. 
because 99% of the population doesn't have this issue, and it just turns out that it's your turn to be that point zero 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 one percent who, you know, breathes water, uh, trips on flat ground, and breaks your collarbone. You know, there's... <clears throat> Hmm, Maison Blanc, St. Gregoire. And I guess it was my turn for that again uh, last night. And there's a little bit of a gripe I have with this. Granted, again, 100% me, 100% my fault. That's, we're, we're just like laying that out first before we actually like go into it any further. Like, I completely admit fault, and I'm, I'm arguing my point from a, a, a point of defeat, basically. But I always found it weird when coming to forms of measurement that there were so many other words they could potentially use. This is, is like, a, oh, I thought that was like a rock with a tree on it. Potentially a bunch of other words you could use. Why do you need to use tablespoon and teaspoon? I mean, yes, it's very easy to memorize what the abbreviations for either are for, but why even get to that point? Could you have one be like tablespoon and the other one just be like fork mound or, you know, any other combination of other letters? It didn't have to be. Okay, we're in the village of flowers. These are like super small town, and I'm really hoping I can actually get to a, uh, um, we've got what? Canal d'Orance. Maybe we're up here. I feel like canals kind of like are a thing up here. Based on absolutely nothing. But. Grand Kayak Club to Eel the, Ro the Isle of Robinson? Robinson Isle? Is that like a thing? Well, there's Jersey. I feel like it's a. Uh, Island in a lake. Don't really think of many like lakes within um, France. But anyway, um, yeah. I'm just sitting there looking at it and I, I was having the brain fire of like, what the fuck's the difference between? I think I actually ended up getting the right one, but I think I might have just swapped the amount of salt and baking soda I was supposed to put in. Instead of putting like a tablespoon of one and a teaspoon of the other, I just flopped them. And. I was just thinking, you know, trying to justify how I'm not completely to blame for this. And just be like, come on, why do you uh, need to use such words? Couldn't you have found, like, a different replacement for them? I feel like I'm maybe in a bigger town. Why isn't this moving? Thank you. Um, we've got... Hmm. Complex, aquatic complex. Man, I gotta... Hmm. Hmm. Um, we're gonna put us Amiens. Okay, we were over here in uh, Ren. Alright, whatever. <clears throat> Instantly, I think this could be South America. But anyway, it was just me feeling mad at myself and taking it out on this is a quite the colorful little uh house you got built here let's go this way maybe get okay this this is uh i really don't know what this is yet this almost feels like a pacific island it could be as well um i don't know this could be maybe thailand or Taiwan, excuse me. Okay, we've got Carlos Alberto Almeida. Okay, so Spanish speaking. This could be Argentina. This could be Chile. This could be Colombia. Venezuela. French Guiana. Can I can I move up the street, please? Thank you. We're outside some large city here. Come on. Getting to focus. Oh my god, thank you. Cantina. Okay, that doesn't help me. Ooh, there's a bus. Bus is gone. I need to see if I can't... Cabral. That does not help me. 
Cabron. Let's see what we got. .br. Oh, we're in Brazil. All right. Site of Joao Pessoa. Pescaria Web, huh? So this is a bit... Hmm. Can I figure this out from here? These are interesting. Like, someone had to hand paint these. Spray paint them on it. My phone is going nuts. Give me a sec. I need to look at this. Um... Okay. Basically, things are going to get more bombs and just replace. Sorry. Okay, sorry. It's a thing with um, learning about houses when you really have no knowledge of things you probably should at this point, like uh, knowing about houses, house financing, house building, things like that. And I'm just kind of understanding this vicariously through other people. I should click a place before I go any further. I'm going to say like Salvador. And <clears throat> home improvement is one of the things. And it's a fine line of, I'm seeing a lot of my friends who basically have zero like handyman experience and with a couple of videos on YouTube and the desire not to spend that much money are very much um, willing to do these things by themselves. And you hear, you, as a kid, the, this is all going somewhere, I swear. As a kid, I would watch a lot of PBS, you know, public broadcasting. And it would be a lot of like, uh, okay, maybe there's a road sign that's going to help me in the next 30 seconds. We're near an aeroport. Um, what does this say? BR-230. Karuru BR-104. Okay, we're down here. I think. And handyman stuff, I would always just watch as like a, something interesting, but never really have. Oh, we were a little farther north. Okay. This is like painfully average. We're getting for a score for this. Oh God, this is either Australia or South Africa. I don't know if I'm going to find enough information and time to suss out what. But just watching these things as a kid and being like, I'm never going to learn how to do floor joists, um, put in dovetail joints, beveled edges, you know, all this stuff that I always just associated with handy people. People far more like experienced, intelligent, okay? This is definitely not. We're back over here with potential for being Sri Lanka again. And now these same people who, I'm sure if you talked to them 20 years ago or 15 years ago, being like, you're going to be excited about replacing all your windows and doing it yourself. I'd be like, this is dumb. I'm never going to do that. And here they are being like, yeah, I'm, we're, we got our guy coming over tonight to uh, give us a quote. And we're going to uh, shop around and, you know, maybe even think about doing it ourselves. And it's not a bad thought, especially with YouTube and, you know, how dubious you want to be with watching anything on YouTube. Um, <clears throat> there's enough instructional videos to basically tell you how to do anything home improvement wise or even build your own home. I mean, there is that primitive arc. No, what the hell is he called? Um... Uh, he is the guy who does like primitive technology stuff, like building houses, building fires, you know, that type of stuff. All right. So I have to figure out where this is. I've not seen a lot of flags anywhere. So it doesn't make me feel like it's a Cambodia or a Thailand thing because they usually have a lot of flags. However, the hand, oh, this is a flag potentially. I'm being limited by my inability to have the goddamn screen focus. Oh my God. I'm angry. Okay, move forward one. I'm going to give... The, okay, thank you. Oh my god, I was getting angry. All blurred. Okay, yep. We got the flag. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. 
Um, it'll put us like here. Although this is a large country and very well could be anywhere, but I feel like I've kind of centered it. Even if I'm end up being wrong and it ends up being Cambodia, I'm not that far from the country. So I've maybe salvaged myself another 3,500 points. I mean, I'm not going for, you know, just like half ass here, but eh. I'm just kind of playing it safe. I got, I got a score I have to do at least a little better than. These are some potholes, buddy. What do we got? What do we, this is a cool little truck though. Almost thought those were all bananas, but they are. Oh God, I know what these things are called. They're like tubers, but they're, hmm, can't remember. It's a lot of them though. It's all nice farmland. I'm going to just call that weed, even though it's not. Is it? I just see fancy pointed leaves. And I'm like, oh, that has to be weed. They're, sell they're making the weed here. Although I think, I don't know if this country in particular, but I know around here that use of drugs are extremely frowned upon. So, uh, okay, maybe this will tell me a bit more where we are. Science gone. God damn it. Okay, I wasn't too far off, so I at least got myself in the 4,000 points. Uh, I really have to pull it on my ass to try to at least get over 20,000 here, and maybe this sign will help me do that. And the sign disappeared. Alright, what do we got coming up here? I feel this is could be South America. Teco. Oh my god, just come into focus. Akbulut Petrol. Okay, now I don't think this could be Turkey. Hmm. Let's see. Yep. We got some yurt gas. Alright, so this is a large enough country where if I don't nail this, I could very easily get below 3,000 points. <clears throat> I have to try to figure out where this is. Do they do a lot of highway signage? The auto gas, that doesn't tell me anything about it. Um, hmm. I'm just going to click forward a bit until I actually see maybe an entrance or exit ramp, and maybe it'll tell me then. To CC. Hmm. Oh. No, I... I Let's see if actually anything demarcates highway signage. Nothing here looks at. Okay, this is just like a... Oh, maybe over here? What do we got? Hmm. Kisvalti Korva. Korva? Is that a... That feels like a town name. Usak, Bukanye. Like, I'm kind of comparing between these two signs here to see if there's any, like, common words. I feel like I just saw that in a previous sign. We're near an airport. Um, I think? Unless it's just the name of it. It's like Airport Cafe. Let's see, what do we got here? Uh, what if I go onto this road over here? I cannot. Okay, this will help me potentially. Do any of these show up anywhere here? I don't think these are like big enough names to show up like this far out. So I gotta like. Pellet Koi, look for that. Hmm, Patnos, no. Or do I get a minute left? This is what I'm pinning it all on, is finding it through this. Kuyulant, didn't I just see that? Uh, I'm going to click here. Oh, this feels more arid. Well, this whole area is arid. 
Hmm. Konya, no. Ag Agasic, no. This one has been a good enough, tough one. You know, there hasn't been too much in the way of a gimme on any of these <clears throat> ones we've gotten so far this week. Uh, oh, fifty. Wait a minute. Was that road on the O fifty two? Was that sign O fifty two? Um. Oh, my mouse is freaking out. Can I find this? Might have been on the O fifty two, and that's what that sign said there. Oh no, we were all the way over here. We got over four thousand, and we just barely squeezed over the twenty thousand. Whoo! All right, don't feel too too bad. I mean, I hope I redeem myself a little bit after uh, the train wreck that was Wednesday. If you didn't see that, go watch for yourself what I'm talking about. And while you do that, uh, remember that I thank you for watching, and if you could please. Like, favorite, comment, subscribe. If you have any comments, questions, complaints, concerns, suggestions, anything at all, any maps you want me to try, anything in general, put them in the comments below. I will read them and get back to them as soon as possible. But until next time, folks, have a good weekend. We'll be here back on Monday with some more guessing geography. Lick,